This video is all about toggle bolts. Toggle bolts are anchors that hold things up in drywall, plaster, or hollow block. Typically, if you have something really heavy to hang up on the wall, you would try to get it into a stud, screw it directly into a wood stud, whether that be a drywall or a plaster wall. But if you can't get it into a stud or if you don't want to put it where a stud is for aesthetic reasons, then you would use something like a toggle bolt. Some of these can hold over 100 pounds sheer weight. In this video, I'll show you a couple examples of toggle bolts, uh, including some of the newer versions of the toggle bolt and demonstrate installation as well as do a weight test and see how much weight these things can actually hold. Here are a few examples, including the self-drilling kind, which you don't even need any power tools for, and the newer snap or strap toggles, which are an improvement of the old style toggle bolts. Uh, there are pros and cons to all of these, which I'll get into. Which kind of toggle bolt would depend on your application? And each of these has a pro and con. All of these will hold more weight than most drywall anchors, most expansion, plastic expansion anchors, as well as picture hangers with nails. You have the old school toggle bolts which can be used in drywall, plaster, and hollow concrete block. You're going to need two hands to install it because you're going to, need, going to need to pull it forward after you get it sprung on the other side of the wall so you can tighten it. So that's a drawback of that. You could get away with a 3 8 inch hole for the smaller one, which is larger than most of the drywall anchors, which will only leave about a quarter of an inch. Or the larger ones, you would need a half inch hole, which is the same size hole as all of these other ones. These toggle bolts cannot be reused, and if you take the item off the wall, the toggle on the other side of the wall will fall off. And then you'd have to get a whole other one to install if you want to put something else up on the wall. It can be used in very thick walls, depending on the size and length of the bolt. So that is definitely a pro. Uh, the drawback is that the bolt itself doesn't fit tightly in the hole, whereas with the snap toggles, uh, there's no way around it. The bolt is going to go exactly in the center of the hole, inside every hole. The driller is a self-drilling toggle bolt. This can be installed without power tools at all, using just a screwdriver with one hand can be used only from 3 8 inch drywall to 5 8 inch drywall and only in drywall. So that is a drawback. The snap toggle is the, probably the easiest to install. You simply drill a half inch hole. This can be used in drywall, plaster, and hollow block. can be used in very thick walls. Both snap toggles and self drillers fit tightly in the hole as opposed to the old style toggle bolts. The way these snap toggles work is you simply drill the half inch hole, push it through, and then pull it tight, and then you push the plastic all the way in so it's flush with the wall. And then the way the anchor really works is when you drill, when you uh, install the bolt, which will have, we'll end up with a two two pieces of material with the drywall in the middle so these all of these anchors are as good as basically the wall they can hold from 70 to 100 pounds and very often the wall itself will start to fail before the actual anchor does if you're going to install hang something very very heavy then you'd probably want to get it into the studs like i said earlier anyway these toggle bolts have different length bolts. You'll probably want at least a two and a half to three inch bolt to fit inside a typical wood stud hollow cavity. 
but also get behind something like plaster. You can drill a three and three eighths inch hole for the smaller one. So that's a uh, so that's something good. And this smaller toggle bolt can actually hold only maybe about 10 pounds, 10 or 15 pounds smaller than the other one. These, these can hold up to 70 pounds. And the other one may be about, uh, I think, 80, 85 pounds, something like that. These self-drillers can hold 90 pounds. When I do the weight test, which you'll see in a minute here, it was actually the, the hooks that failed. Remember, if you're going to be installing something into these anchors, it's only going to be as strong as its weakest part. So if you have an anchor that only holds 50 pounds, it's not going to hold much more than that, as I show you in a second here. These smaller hooks will probably not hold very much weight before they start to break. Of course, you could be installing something like a thick shelf bracket, which isn't going to bend or break. So then it would basically hold up whatever you're installing to the wall. But as far as hanging heavy mirrors or heavy pictures, you're going to want to have a strong hook as well as these anchors. These are demonstrations where you see on the other side of the wall, which you typically don't get to see. So this is useful to see what exactly happens on the other side of the wall. As I said earlier, you need two hands for the toggle bolt, so you see I don't, I'm not able to hold the camera and pull the... Uh, the hook forward as I turn the bolt. These are half inch holes already pre-drilled so you can put the uh, depends on the brand some are called these are called flip toggles they're basically the same thing as the snap toggle or strap toggle. This particular one you push through and then pull back and that little piece of plastic pulls it so that it's vertical. The snap toggle has two parts, two plastic parts, which you just uh, you put back together once it's behind the wall. And then you'll be able to push the plastic part all the way forward until it's flush. It's a little flange that goes over the drywall, and then you want to make it as tight as possible. And then you snap off the plastic. It's very simple. But you'll see here I use a uh, luggage scale and I pull up with the amount of force and you see about, about how much weight each of these can hold. The smaller picture hanger was able to hold a good amount of weight and it didn't start to break at all. The 50 pound OOK picture hook which I use in this uh, toggle bolt the toggle anchor worked fine, but the picture hook bent when it got to about 80 pounds. So it actually went 30 pounds beyond its uh, rate, its weight rating. There are other hooks that, hooks that supposedly can hold up to 100 pounds. So I'm wondering if that even would have happened. But it depends on what you're installing to the wall and how heavy it is, what kind of hook you want to use. And these snap toggle, basically the same thing as the flip toggle. Just push it through the half inch hole, push the plastic part till it's flush to the drywall, and then you snap off the plastic. From there, you'll be able to insert the bolt, and you can take it in and out, and it'll stay in. That's another benefit to that compared to the toggle bolts. But if these look like they'll work for your application there will be a link in the description and i hope this video was helpful please subscribe for more tips just like these